And while we're here, I want to try and steal this painting of the outsider. I'm not sure if we're going to be able to actually do it. We just got another bone charm as well. This is definitely one we don't want. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna we're gonna do a hard save real quick. Perfect. How old is that game, Eakin? Sounds really nifty. I don't play a lot of ARPGs though. We're also gonna grab all of the gold we can while we're up here, or all of the coins we can while we're up here, I should say. Oh, I also need to go burn Milky. Almost forgot about that. 2016, uh, it's only a year old. is a bone charm directly below us. I think we're gonna grab that on our way out after we release Dow. We burn the dog. We're gonna go around and steal some loot real quick. Or some more loot, I should say. So now we're in neutral territory, so we don't need to worry about getting spotted, but we're gonna stay crouched anyway. We're gonna take that spring razor just in case we encounter a pack of dogs that we need to kill. <clears throat> because while we can kill dogs, being spotted by dogs does count as being spotted. Some more bath salts. These are valuable. And this is our fourth bone charm. This one's only, this one's I think a random drop. There's only one in this area that's not a random drop. So we only came, we only actually came up here to grab that bone charm. It's the only thing in this area that's actually of use. So I'm not really sure how we're going to steal this painting because after Doll disappears, the painting disappears. But I think if we steal it before. See what that does to the skin and bones. I don't think we can steal it from up here. It's kind of weird. <laughs> Alright, that's fine. We're just not gonna worry about it. Let's go ahead and go back downstairs. And then release Dowd, because we can just walk up in the middle of all of them, because it's neutral territory, and pull the release valve on him. Hey, friends! You're fighting the black magic brute? Why don't you roll in sardine paste and swim through hagfish waters? Instead. That's a note saying don't release him. And as soon as we release him, he immediately knocks everyone out, see? Because he is a badass. He is a badass. Lurk. I knew you'd seek me And I out. believe it doesn't trigger us being seen either. Yeah, again, fiddle kills, spotted, spotted enemies. One day, I didn't think it would be like this. You were hard to find. How uh, did you end up here? Wonderful down. 
Now let's talk somewhere else. The Eyeless have more secrets than you know. I've got a ship. Or what's left of it. The Dreadful Whale. It's docked below the Akintila repair station. Dowd, I... Say whatever you want to say, Billy. That you're here now is enough. I need your help. She wanted to apologize because we've backstabbed him in the past. Those days are gone. This is something bigger. One last hey, job. I can do it. You're gonna die. Who's the mark? Don't say it that way, Steen. The one responsible for it all. Dowd is a wonderful human Cults. being. The black magic. This mark on my hand. He's probably the nicest We're assassin kill that the ever black lived. Guy bastard himself. What? Maybe not nicest, but he's morally. You want to kill the outsider? You want to kill God? Yes, we do. I finally find him, and the old man's got me jumping right back into this occult shit. <laughs> Dowd can explain himself back on the dreadful whale. All right, so here's the deal. We're going to take all this money. And after we came through here and killed or choked out everybody, they get raided by the police, essentially. The overseers. Dowd, I know you're awesome for an assassin, but you're going to die soon, just so you know. Spoiler, Steen. I'm throwing in a, in a quick save real quick. And then we're going to come back up here because since this place is getting raided, there's now more enemies in here. Which means we have to be careful again. I believe there should be an overseer right over here. Maybe not? I don't remember. The other thing is we don't have our scouting. There they are. Aren't the streets feeling safer already? We should have gotten that guy before he saw us. Yeah, again. Was that Pepier? Pepier? I don't know what Pepier is. Sorry, Steen. So we need to be careful here because the other guy guard saw him get knocked out. However, it's, it shouldn't be too much of an issue because I think they just continue along their path to walk out here. To grab her gold. And hers. Although she had she had raw whalebone. Which isn't quite as good. So hopefully this guy doesn't turn around. Alright. One down. Should be another guy on the other side of here. I think he usually paths over there. At least I have a job, which is more needed. We should be able to just walk past him. Because he gets fairly distracted. Okay, and... We still don't know the passcode to this, unfortunately. Looks like they replaced it with a better one. <laughs> they used to have this safe here, and now... Now it's this safe. And this one actually has a passcode, whereas it looks like this one just used to have a key. So I really don't know. Any ideas, chat? I don't, let's look at our mission clues real quick. I don't think we read anything that would have showed us. Yep. Nothing. I don't know. Okay. So here's this guard. We need to be careful because... He actually can see all the way to this window, I think, if I'm, remember I'm remembering correctly. So you need to wait until he turns around, or... There he goes. Uh, yeah. oh, is it laundry 
day yet. Oh, it's gotta be soon. I can't stand my own stench. Where is this guy? We just heard him talking. Come on. I don't have time for games. They just hear me? It sounded like they did. Weird. I'll check her. Yeah, they did just hear me. Okay, so we're gonna throw one of these things right here. See if we can catch a guy and pull him through there. We don't really know where they are right now, especially since we can't mark them. Come on, let's have a fair fight. Hey, coward, come fight face to face. Think so when he opens this Can door. Imagine that. No, I'm sure. That should be two down. We just pulled them right through that door when they walked through. We're gonna check our stats again. Yep, good to go. Only one left. Maybe we can just grab him. Nice! It has been done! This is the guy earlier. We dragged him over here again so those people wouldn't see him. It's like we're good to go. Let's go meet up with Dao. I'm gonna conserve our knocking out ammo as much as we can because it is very valuable and often more limited in resource value than uh, lethal ammo. Uh, let's stay. I want to just double check before we complete this mission. Make sure we haven't been seen. And we're good to go. Return to the dreadful whale. Nice. Okay, so first mission. Successful. Lethality, zero. Merciful, didn't kill anyone. And stealth, not seen by anyone. Ghostly never detected. Although we did have bodies detected, which is meh. It's fine. We didn't get the one painting because Dowd took it. Which is a bit lame, but that's fine. We're not going for all achievements like we did in the last one. Or all the contracts. Like we did in our last playthrough. Any key. When I first caught sight of Dowd, I was just a broken kid. Staying alive out of spite. He cut the throats of three men without making a sound. Leaving only blood and death in his wake. I don't know what I was hoping for when I followed him that night. But he shared his strange magic with me. And more than that, his skill, his time, his trust, and sometimes his secrets. Now he's not the man he was. Here in his final days, he feel and regrets as sharp as mine. I know how much that carves you up inside, but I found him. And he wants me to help him make up for a lifetime of oh, sins. Dad by killing a god. The Abbey teaches us that the outsider preys on weakness. That the void is the source of doubt, heresy, and suffering. 
that the outsider is to blame for all our ills. Is he? Who knows? Maybe so this playthrough, we're going to be sparing the outsider, unlike the last playthrough, because this is a no-kill playthrough. Same dream. While our last playthrough was an all-kill playthrough. My eye hollow and burning. It still aches. Let's hope it's not some kind of omen. Let me tell you something about the void, Billy Lark. It touches the minds of the dreaming and the dying alike. And sometimes, dreams can only tell you what you wanted to forget. I know who you are. Why are you here? What do you want from me? People usually want something from what me. What in the void? But you don't want my mark, do you, Billy? So I will return something you lost. Wait, what are you? The world was wounded around you. <gasps> and you carry the scars. You will never be the same. I wonder if you'll make them. What did he do to me? He oh, cut so my shit. arm off. Shit, shit. He took my arm and my face. Is it because of the dreams? Or doubt? We play a mean guitar. So we took our arm because in the alternate reality, our arm was taken from us and he's able to, I guess, convert us to that reality. Let's talk to Doubt. What happened to you? The outsider did this. What did he say? I've had bad dreams for a while now and he was never there. But I feel good, strong, like all those years ago when we ran together. He didn't offer me his mark. Just said some cryptic shit and left. Just said this. some cryptic shit and left. That guy bastard wanted. Be careful. The outsider's gifts come with a price. You won't know until it's already been paid. <coughs> I didn't have much choice. Neither do I. My connection to the void is fading. We've got to act soon before it takes me forever. You found a way to do it. To kill the outsider. How? I spent years looking for an answer. I searched the aisles, tracked down a dozen crazy cults. But there's more to the Eyeless. They've got a relic the knife that made the outsider. Thousands of years ago, it's here in Karnaka. A knife. The interesting thing is. So you want we're not gonna have to do, we're not doing all the contracts this run through because some of them are actually almost impossible to do and where without they keep being that seen. knife they're powerful people wealthy or and some of them are both. impossible to do without know their names but they killing. all have an esoteric tattoo that sets them apart those low-ranking thugs at the boxing club talked about getting inked in the red camellia in the upper Syria district I'll go there and see what I can find try to rest out I couldn't do this on my own anymore, Billy. Thank you. Oh, Dal. He's so sick. It's kind of sad. All right. Can we be careful of your arm and eye. All our lives. You can't know. The Abbey the of the Everyman tells us to hate him. And he's always watching. The void That's not. So this is our alternate reality. My arm, my eye. It's just like the dreams. Pictures that held the um, correct reality are no longer like totally existent, and you can see in this other one we don't have an arm and an eye. It's been. A Thanks for learning the skiff. We'll follow the coast east to slip past the port guards. Rua says the Aristos are gasping for wind down caviar, so that's our cargo. We'll be back next week. I'll stow the boat in the water lock in Upper Syria district, like we talked about. Don't worry, I'll take good care of it. I know it's a sturdy skiff worth its weight in coin these days, Marlin. Long time okay. since those days. Where did you find that? Alright, Dowd's journal. She found me, I'm not surprised, only grateful. If anyone in the Isles could have found me, it was, it was Lurk. She's just as capable as she always was. I remember when she was young, she wasn't the first street kid to join my gang, but she was the first to show real promise. I took her in and oversaw her training myself. She took the life more quickly and more desperately than most. I watched her grow up, get stronger, faster. She was always trying to impress me. But each year she became a little more ruthless, a little colder. She liked wearing that mask. True. I turned her into what she was, just like the outsider made me. When she betrayed me, I had no one to blame but myself. Now she's something else. I'm not sure what, 
I'm not sure what. I can't guess the kind of life she's led without me, who she's hurt, or who she's cared about. She knows that I forgave her a long time ago, but I wonder, sometimes, if she ever thought to forgive me. I Probably not. that face in years. Alright, so we have all our powers now, which is really going to be very, very helpful. I... What has the outsider done to me? Powers! Yeah, it's going to make, especially the scouting one, and the impersonation one, is going to make sneaking up on people so much easier. All right, we're gonna go to Upper Syria. I think it's pronounced Syria. Kyria? I'm not sure. Let's go get the special twin-bladed knife that is being held up somewhere in Upper Syria. Syria. Probably Syria. So I'm not sure if this is neutral territory or not. Go ahead and loot all this stuff in here. Got an incendiary bolt, but again. But again. Those types of bolts aren't particularly useful. Okay, so this is hostile territory. We need to be a bit careful. We're gonna get over here to the Red Camilla. Another day like yesterday, and I think I'll give it up for good. Better off in the void than another day like that. There's just tutorials. You already know how to use all these powers. Let's go ahead and look around and mark some people. This worker, I think, will spot us. These are all civilians. They don't matter a huge amount. Hmm. Let's try dropping in next to him. I'm gonna drag him around this corner into the alley. People shouldn't find them in here, and then we're gonna go around back. No 100% self and 100% looting. No, no, not loot. Oh, Jesus. These are dogs. No, we're not gonna be doing 100% looting. We're doing 100% stealth. Exactly. We're gonna be looting as much as we can we're not going to worry about it too, too much. <laughs> We're going to be killing all of the dogs, apparently. So, 100% not killing people, but 100% but death to dogs ratio. No, I'm having to suppress my inner looting to make sure we do this correctly. You killed the dogs, 100% dog kill. That's right. <laughs> Fortunately, they don't actually count towards the no kill in the stats. So we can kill as many dogs as we want, which is a bit strange. But it kind of makes sense because there's an actual mission to kill dogs. So there's also a mission to kill people, so... That's 
smell. What are they mixing these inks with? Alright. These are all the people, the important people, Sean Yun, that a are and a city in this cult. Ivan Jacobi. These are high profile people. There's a third leader mentioned, but no name. Hmm. This must Let's be. Let's go ahead and tattoo ourselves. Just because we can. It might come in handy later if we do end up wanting to go into the private bar. I always wanted to join a cult. All right. If this is what it takes. Don't flinch. Don't, fi don't flinch, Billy. 